Hello everyone. Today, we're exploring the medication known as Tazerac. As always, this discussion is for educational purposes. If you have health-related concerns or questions, it's essential to consult a medical professional. Description Tazerac is a compound similar to vitamin A, aiding the skin in renewing itself more rapidly, potentially enhancing its appearance and texture. It is primarily prescribed to treat acne vulgaris in adults and adolescents aged 12 and above. Additionally, Tazerac is used to address plaque psoriasis in adults, manifesting as raised, silvery skin flaking. This medication is available in both cream and gel forms. Warnings Tazerac can lead to birth defects, so it's imperative not to use it if you're pregnant. Ensure you're using effective birth control to avoid pregnancy. If you become pregnant, cease using Tazerac immediately and inform your doctor. Also, be cautious as you might get sunburned more easily. It's advisable to avoid direct sunlight, tanning beds, and sun lamps. Ensure you're using sunscreen and wearing protective clothing and eyewear when outdoors. It's worth noting that your skin might initially appear worse before showing improvement. Before taking this medicine. You shouldn't use Tazerac if you're allergic to it, pregnant, or potentially becoming pregnant. A negative pregnancy test within two weeks before starting this treatment is mandatory. Inform your doctor if you've ever had eczema, sunburn, or other skin conditions. Skin cancer. Lentigo maligna, a type of skin cancer. Allergic reactions to skin products. Outdoor work. Breastfeeding while using this medication might not be safe, so consult your doctor about potential risks. Tazerac cream and gel shouldn't be used to treat acne in children under 12. The gel form isn't recommended for treating psoriasis in anyone below 12, and the cream form isn't advised for anyone under 18. Dosage Tazerac is typically applied once daily, either in the evening or at bedtime. Ensure you follow all directions on the prescription label and any accompanying guides. It's crucial not to ingest Tazerac, it's strictly for topical use. Avoid applying it to open wounds, sunburned, windburned, dry, chapped, or irritated skin. If the medicine contacts your eyes, nose, mouth, rectum, or vagina, rinse with water immediately. Store Tazerac at room temperature, away from moisture and heat, and ensure it doesn't freeze. For plaque psoriasis in adults, the initial dose involves applying a thin film of the 0.05% gel or cream once daily in the evening, covering only the psoriatic lesions. The dose can be increased to 0.1% based on tolerance and medical advice. For acne treatment in adults and adolescents age 12 and above, a thin layer of the 0.1% gel or cream should be applied once daily in the evening, covering the acne lesions. Side effects Like all medications, Tazerac can have side effects. Some individuals might experience severe skin irritation, including pain, dryness, flaking, peeling, burning, stinging, and itching. Other side effects include blistering or peeling skin, severe redness, discomfort, or signs of skin infection. Common side effects encompass dry, scaly, or peeling skin, skin pain, redness, burning, or itching. Always consult your doctor about any side effects and report any new or unusual symptoms. Interactions Tazerac might interact with other medications. If you're also using a benzoyl peroxide acne medication, ensure you don't use it simultaneously with Tazerac. Apply one in the morning and the other in the evening. Inform your doctor about all other medications you're taking, especially antibiotics or other medicines that can heighten your skin sensitivity to sunlight. FAQ A common question is about the difference between Tazerac and Retin-A. While they both belong to the retinoid drug class, they aren't the same. Retin-A is a first-generation retinoid, whereas Tazerac is a third-generation retinoid. They have distinct chemical structures but work similarly for acne treatment. However, Tazerac might work faster and be more effective for certain signs of sun-damaged skin and aging. Closing That concludes our overview of Tazerac. Remember, this information is meant for educational purposes and shouldn't replace professional medical advice. Always consult with a healthcare provider for any questions or concerns. Thank you for joining us.